hello everyone and welcome back to my channel so i'm back with another git command that is git checkout so in my previous video i have shown you how you can create branches using git branch command so in this video i will show you how you can switch to a particular branch so what basically git checkout does it it used to switch branches or restore working tree files so mostly we use it for switching like to a different branch so let me show you now how we can do this so firstly let me show you branches so for that write command git branch so you can see all my local branches master task and tutorial now let uh, right now you can see i am on tutorial branch you can see the green and star one so currently i'm on tutorial one so let me switch it to, like switch to uh, another branch let's say master only so git checkout master now again write now again write git branch and now you can see master is in green color so right now i am on master branch so let me make it more clear to you by creating one file let's say i am in master branch so let me just create one file let's say master.php so now let me commit my local changes so firstly write git and dot and after that write git commit and with one message so let's say master file added or something so you need to commit your local changes before switching to a different branch as you don't want to lose your work whatever you have done in that particular branch so now let's uh, check out to another branch now let's say task so write git checkout or task now you can see master.php is closed as in task branch there is no file such as like master.php because that is in our master branch not in our task branch so our file also got changed according to our branch so now in task branch let me create new file with task.php name so now you can differentiate in master i am having master.php in task branch i am having task.php now i am going to commit local changes so write git add dot and write git commit with a message so here i am going to commit my task local changes into my task branch so now let me just uh, switch to my master branch and i just want to show the difference what exactly checkout branch is going to do so let me just clear the terminal now write the uh, git checkout and i'm going to switch to master branch so write git checkout master so right now you can see i'm having task.php file but if i switch to master then there will be no task.php file so there task.php file will be uh, removed and i have saved my master.php file in master branch so that will be there so basically you're working uh, your all files that are stored in your particular branch let's say master so all these files will be present for in your working tree if you will switch to master branch now you can see i'm having file master.php and if i'll switch back to task branch so then you can see i'm having my task.php file so i have shown you how you can switch to a different branch using git checkout command so that's all in this video i hope you like this video you can comment down below in the comment section if you have any doubts related to this topic thank you so much for watching